last night I was uh, uh, sort of at the last minute invited to be on uh, Lawrence O'Donnell's show, The Last Word on MSNBC. And the, uh, the, the setup for it was the comment that Susan Sarandon made which had been widely reported as saying that she would vote for Trump instead of Clinton. But in fact, that's not what she said at all. Uh, what she basically said was, she, she, you know, if, if uh, Bernie's not the nominee, she's not who, sure who she'll vote for. And, and so anyhow, they, they put me, and, and, I'm, and I've been saying all along, I think that that's not a, a wise position. Uh, I think that, you know, you have to say, you're, you know, uh, unless you want Ted Cruz or John Kasich or... Uh, Paul Ryan or, or, God forbid, Donald Trump running our government, uh, or at least running the executive branch of it, then you need to vote for whoever the Democratic nominee is. So, uh, you know, they, they went looking for somebody who would be a Bernie or bust person, you know, uh, to debate me on this, I guess. Or, or you know, uh, Susan Sarandon being the news hook for the whole thing. And they found uh, what what they got was Nina Turner, who is, uh, you know, the former state senator from Ohio, who is a Bernie surrogate and is absolutely brilliant. She's been on this program. She's been on our TV show. And I, just one of the smartest politicians I've ever met in my whole entire life. She, I, I just, every time, every time I see her being interviewed and every time I interview her, I'm just blown away by this, by the way this woman's brain works. I mean, you know, it's just like, it's like, I, I, almost, almost like a machine. She really understands politics. She really understands this, these issues. And she is so clear and so concise in the way that she lays it out and so rapid fire, frankly. So anyhow, the point that she made last night, and I thought it was fascinating. You know, in, in fact, I, I give her this point. I, I, I agree with her. Was she said, I'm not saying that I'm not going to vote for Hillary. What I'm saying is that she's going to have to earn my vote, just like any politician has to earn my vote. As of this moment, Bernie has earned my vote. Uh, if he's not the nominee, Hillary's going to have to earn my vote. I'm, you know, I fully expect that she will do everything she can to earn my vote. And if she does, great, I'll vote for her. And I thought, wow, what a common sense approach. I mean, you know, this is. And she also said that she felt that it was somewhat disrespectful of uh, of Bernie and his campaign to even be asking the question, frankly, which I think is also true. Although that's that's what politics is made out of. I mean, that's or at least political commentary. All the networks are like, well, what happens if this? What happens if that? It's all these hypotheticals, and uh, hypotheticals are not unreasonable. So. You know, I just, I, I, I wanted to share that. I thought it was interesting. Um, uh, we'll see, you know, we're, we, like, you know, I, like I keep, keep saying, we'll see where all this goes. To watch more clips from our programs, hit the watch more videos button over here. And please be sure to hit the handy dandy subscribe button. So you'll always be up to date. Tag, you're it.